Get ready to have your mind blown. Hi Vogue, I'm Karen Gillan and this is my natural makeup look. Starting off with a bang. This is a cocoa cream cleanser. Start to rub in. I'm just going to go and mix it with some water and I'll be right back. I'm back and I've washed my face. Now I'm going to move on to my favorite part of my process, healing gel. This I, I love because it feels really healing and calming when you put it on your skin and there's hardly any ingredients in it. I will put three squirts of this into my palm. One, two, three. Take this flavonoid complex, three squirts. Come on, you can do it, flavonoid. Okay, so what this does is it creates a barrier uh, between your skin and all of the elements outside and also between your skin and makeup, which is something I really need. Now a little bit of moisturizer. I'm trying to be more gentle with my skin rather than the furious. <laughs> you only get one set of skin in your life and so therefore you should just treat yourself or swipe samples from the airport or something. Go in with the eye cream. It's just so good. And it comes with this fun little applicator, which it's like a cold ball under the eye. And then I sort of pat it and then go over the top. Make sure you get the upper lids too. And with this, I will kind of go here on, on these. I don't know if these are laughter lines, but and anywhere where you feel like you need a little extra moisture. I'm sort of immune to a lot of lip balms, so. This one's working for me right now, but it will probably change. Okay, so now that my skin is prepared, I can start to do my makeup, which is something I love to do. I really love makeup. I feel like I'm painting a picture or something. Skin Long Wear Weightless Foundation SPF 15. And then I take my Beauty Blender, which is very good for applying evenly. You can apply a thin layer uh, and then you can build up in the areas that you want to. Just go in with a little brush and add a little more foundation under the eyes just to kind of get the old shopping bags covered. I don't go too nuts with the powder. I don't really like a very powdered look. But I like to just take the shine off. I'm probably going to do a little bit of blusher because I'm, I'm armed with this already. A nice shade of pink. Put this on my apples. Very youthful color. Maybe a little on the nose. Someone also told me once, if you come down here, you look way younger. What do you think? I'm going to move on to the brow. So I've just been using a pencil. I'm going to make my brows stand upright with this gel. And sort of brush backwards a little bit and then upwards. I'm going to open up the eyes with a little mascara. I'm just gonna do a little lick of this. I like to do the bottom ones as well. A little bit more of a 60s vibe. This is my freckle pen. But what this really is, is a graphic design pen. Basically, I use this to paint on freckles because I love freckles so much. And weirdly, I don't have as many as other ginger people naturally have. I find them to just be so cute and actually so anti-aging. What I do is I just kind of lightly dot all over the areas where I do naturally have freckles, but they're just more faint. And then also I like to do some on the forehead. Just kind of dab to sort of just blend them in a little bit and kind of like make them into your base. That is my natural makeup look. Post skincare regime. And that's it. Hi Vogue, I'm Karen Gillen and to watch more Vogue videos, subscribe here.